Hello. I wanted to show you guys a piece that my now husband and I found and put in our house. Um, shoot, once I put this camera on like selfie mode, I can't change it back. Oh, there it is. Look at this big gray wall we had in our foyer. And I know probably a lot of people have this same kind of wall. It's just a very huge, um, <laughs> long empty wall. So you need something big to go on it, right? Well, we searched and searched and had, you know, a million different ideas for it and ended up finding this gem, which looks like, it looks like maybe, you know, a real portion of a fence. I mean, because it's, it's super, that's, that's, that's a real fence portion. That's, that's a real fence piece. But, um, we liked how it was, you know, the paint was worn. It's chalk paint. I guess it's chalk paint. I don't know. It's not, it's, it's not chipping off. Someone may have, someone may have painted it that, to look that way and then sold it. I don't know, because down here at the bottom, it looks like, it looks like it has some wear and where it might have stopped. Um, you can see where it was cut here. But, um, so it does look like a, a real, just a real piece of fence. Um, and then all we did since we liked the look of it is he screwed it to the wall, which was scary because this thing is up here. It's not going anywhere. It's got screws in it. Um, it is not going anywhere. If someone runs into it, they're going to hurt themselves. But, um, so, you know, then the next battle was finding how to decorate it. I really wanted a North Carolina sign big enough to fill up most of this middle part. And I wanted to spell home here, but I couldn't find one of these boogers to go here. So um, I ended up just looking and looking and found these little pieces that I could just hang and they were like three bucks. So I got two of them and this one says home sweet home. And this one says, come in, we are awesome. I love that. It was, it was kind of funny. So I did that. Um, and then since I still wanted the North Carolina thing, I just went ahead and found this um, small one at Walmart and um, painted it gray to match the wall. And I got it up here with some Velcro. And then we spent a lot of time at the um, antiques malls around town. And they always, always, always have these um, cotton things. It's, that's not real cotton. Um, it, I guess it was probably an empty vine. I don't know. The whole thing may, might be fake. I have no idea. But anyways, we got two of those and... I slapped them up there um, in a way that I thought looked cool. So that's just an idea. I've seen some other things that would work for something similar to this. I saw like a, a smaller um, like fence portion um, that would have worked in the same way, like on a smaller wall. Um, but I'm, I'm seeing a lot of these in stores now. Um, people are using them also for headboards. You know, that would have been a good headboard for a twin bed. Or if you had two of them, you could make um, a headboard for a bigger bed. Um, two or more, or however many it might take. But, um, so these little fence portions are great um, to, to make things from um, or to accent a wall with. <laughs> um, and I, I'm pretty proud of that piece. And... Um, we both just love it and it's original. And so I just wanted to show you, give you the idea if, um, keep an eye out for those fence portions because you can do stuff with those. Okay. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Bye.